Hello everybody and welcome back. This is TechMatic. Thank you for sharing your time with me today. And before the sun goes down inside of Nightingale, we're going to talk about collecting resources from the requirement of having 230 um, on your axe, your pickaxe, or any other collecting resource like the sickle, uh, fishing pole, and so forth. So before we go ahead and do that, I'm going to go ahead and eat some food because my character is uh, kind of dying out here. But as you can see, our item level is pretty high. But it all comes down to the item level of the resource gathering tool that you're going to use. So here we have a rugged axe pick. You're going to get this once you get to the watch. Um, you can attempt to go ahead and create a lower level refined axe, but it's not going to get there. Uh, rugged is going to be where it's at. So with this uh, pelicidic, we're aiming for melee damage. Melee damage helps destroy nodes faster. Uh, with this combination of an axe and a pick, it's highly incentivized to go ahead and use it. To go ahead and get the item level to be 235 or above 230 in general, you're going to have to go ahead and use infusions like the melee damage uh, times 3, magic damage times 3, uh, durability. So whatever stat is on this axe, you're going to have to increase it through infusions. Another thing that you have to keep in mind is that you're also going to push the item level up with enchantments. So I have Arbor, Shield, Recovery, and Quake on this item as well. That's going to go ahead and push the item level up, and it's going to surpass that 235 or 230 requirement for some of the nodes like this one that we see before us. There's a number of different uh, resources out there that require the item of the tool to be above 230. And that can also be done on multiple collection tools like the sickle itself. Here I've got, you know, uh, negative weight for the tool itself, melee damage, durability. And then, of course, I've got the enchantments there as well. Keep in mind that it's also important to build your weapons around whatever stat you have. So these two collection tools have melee focused ingots, uh, handles, poles um, and blades that are used so you can get a lot of these materials from farming the watch and going through the dungeons uh, the apex portals that are there you're going to collect not only the epic essences that you're going to require but you're going to also get the sun god pelicidic ingots that are going to go ahead and help in the creation of these rugged tools there's also an npc that sells these rugged tools right there in the lobby itself so once you get this, uh, I highly incentivize that you focus on creating these tools right off the bat and, you know, spending your essences right away on the infusions. If you infuse with a common or rare, you're not going to get the same uh, item level jump as you would a legendary. So once you get the infusion for the excellent bench, again, which is sold at the watch, you can go ahead and... Uh, by the workbench that you can go ahead and create these at and that focus the excellent focus is going to go ahead and allow you to craft epic as well and then of course you're going to need a lot of other materials but it's pretty much uh what you need to aim to do in order to go ahead and collect these resources so i hope that this helps you out um again go ahead and uh create based off of what your materials are in your bag so something like critical damage or this one, which automaton, you know, you want to look at those melee strength block efficiency and durability. You want to pay attention to what stats you're putting into your armor so that you can actually um, go ahead and create some really nice things. Like I was able to go ahead and create these gloves, which go ahead and increase my melee damage, range damage. And of course, all of this is done through infusions and enchantments, uh, which is really nice to go ahead and understand. But thank you very much for your time. I hope this helped you out. Please like, subscribe, share, and I will see you all in the next one. Have a nice night.